So Joseph just took out the front fender for this side, the driver's side, and then he's going to take off the passenger's fender right now. Now the reason why we're taking the fenders off is because um, we're trying to eliminate this rust that's building up so we need to go bare metal and we noticed that uh, this fender has been done before and if you take a piece of this uh, chunk off look at how thick the bondo is there's like a big thick layer and we need to basically just scrape all this off sand it down so we can get to bare metal and we can eliminate the rust that's happening. Oh look, check this out. The car right now is like a gray slash, I don't know, I'm just gonna call it gray. But the original like OEM paint I think it was, is like a green slash emerald blue, cause you can see it from right here. And you could also see it in like some parts of the car too. Like for the hood, you can see like underneath. It's actually kinda hard to see right now. Right. Add that dance in the morning. <laughs> She's getting groovy. <laughs> Okay, so now we're gonna start sanding the MR2 bumper. Here's the bumper. I'm just playing this one. The MR2 color is red. Okay, crimson red, just like Rius. Can I put a Rius sticker on your car? Who's that? <laughs> Who's that? Only the best waifu to ever exist. Sandy? Who's she talking about that? I don't know. I think he's missing his girlfriend. Yeah. No. He's a mechanic girlfriend. I'm he a lonely driver. When are you gonna put that sticker on? Wash my car first and then I'll put it. It's funny how I said back then, I was like, I don't like stickers on cars. Now you're gonna make me put a sticker on my car. You have Rius on there. I don't want Rius on there. It doesn't match. Wow, yeah. It's a light here. Ah, uh, forgot their names. Oh, wait, no. It's not Ozia, right? It's the Lolly one? No, not her. Oh, Razwaisa or something? 
Roswire or Graphia? Graphia? <laughs> you know. You know which one I'm talking about. I do. This bumper is really long. And it uh, looks like you're having a lot of fun. Like, look how long it is. It's from over there all the way over here. Okay, on today's episode of the MR2, Joseph and my dad finished sanding the fenders and the front bumper. So if you don't remember, the fenders had like a thick layer of Bondo over it and they finally finished and here's the end product. So this is one of the fenders and remember there was like a Bondo, like a thick layer of Bondo in this area. Now we completely eliminated that and sanded it down. So now we just gotta fix a few dents here and there. Some welding in some areas. Look, this light can go in here and then we can put the cover for that. We gotta repair these cracks. And the same thing goes for the left, left side of the fender. Yo, this looks cool. It looks like a, like a army, army camo. And here's the front bumper. Don't we still need to sand some of the bumper off though? No. Or you don't have to go no. get rid of the red? This one's like... Here's what the car looks like. You wanna see the With the bumper, this is like the first time we've put the front bumper on the car. So. Look at this view. Too small. I'm pretty sure those, the, 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 this part, but not the. Well, see, that's why when we go to, to the glass, to the dealer, we can buy we can buy uh, the Beamer ones. Does it fit on that? No, because they make the hole too big. See? Uh huh. That's that's what I'm, that's what I meant earlier. Should we weld it to make it tighter or no? I was thinking to find a... Uh, because he doesn't have the other piece. Mm -hmm. The glass. And this one's a now OEM. Because OEMs don't have these. So the ones from the Beamer, they fit over here because they're five, in, uh, five inches long. Oh, the light? The light. The light cover? Ah, interesting. Interesting. Oh yeah, it's way different. Well, they look pretty cool, isn't it? Well, these? Yes. Yes. Once we paint this part, mm -hmm. they're gonna look cool. So we're gonna use those on the MR2? No, we're gonna go to the dealer and find one. Oh. Shout out E36. Are you gonna put this car in an operation? You did? When did you do that? Yesterday. Did you talk about the MR2 too? Hmm? Did you talk about the MR2 too? No. What? Where you went? I want you to close your eyes. Your eyes. This is the most beautiful place in the world. This side looks cool, it looks like a camo, like gray. That told me it looks like the army. Yeah, it looks cool. You should keep it like you know, that. A lot of people they just spray. Just put clear coat. Uh, yeah, a lot of people they just spray clear coat and it looks nice. I 
this if this car finishes it's gonna say what the I don't know why did I sold that car. I should have kept that car. I mean he didn't even do anything with it anymore. He just let it sat there until it rocked. Yeah. So I'll be playing games inside all day long, you know? Driving driving cars in games. I could be driving this car in real life. You really want to, you can start feeling good. Once you fill a hole. Such a nice freaking car, dude. Right here, you fill this, put the handles inside. Such a nice freaking car, dude. You don't want them to get rusty. The color is going to be midnight purple. Bro, what? This ain't <laughs> Nissan? <laughs> Good job on your sanding. I do we can fix the crack here. I kind of want to reuse this kit. Well, we have to reuse it. Like that. We gotta repair that and reuse it. It's fiberglass. This guy tried copying the... Good job on the sanding. Good job. Did a good job. You and Joseph. Thanks, dude. Thanks. Welcome. 